Hi, I'm Rob Mullen. In 2004, I called up the Smithsonian Institution with a concept for an exhibition that I had. Specifically, I contacted the National Museum of Natural History with an idea to combine art, science, and adventure in an educational exhibition on the Royal Forest. It's a long story how that came to pass, and one basically of a, a stubborn fool uh, rushing in where angels fear to tread, happily in a good way. The, um, you could suffice it to say that now, there's a good reason why most people don't go cold calling the Smithsonian with exhibition proposals. <laughs> this project has consumed much of my professional life, which is to say much of my life since, as the old bromide goes, being an artist isn't what you do, it's what you are. Um, however, for me it goes beyond that. It goes beyond my art and it goes beyond the boreal forest. I was first sensitized to something profoundly larger than me uh, or any, any number of people back in the 1980s. When as a tonic to my urban life as a freelance advertising artist, I went on long canoe trips in northern Canada. That sensitivity has only grown with these subsequent art journeys. As you travel further and further north, past the end of the last road, the veneer of civilization falls away, revealing the primordial grandeur of Mother Earth. It provides a unique perspective from which to look back on our place in the world. In the vast quiet of a wilderness land, without the distracting clutter of modern creations and comforts, you can sense deep time and the wild non-human world of our origin that underlies and supports all we know and believe to be ours. That it will forever support anything we want is not a given. That sense of priority is the larger background message that I want to flow from this exhibition. Thank you.